Now turn off the lasers. Uh, NPC randomly turned around as I grabbed the key card. Watch out. Nice. I don't know done. why. I was feeling on good on that one. Like normally NPCs just they just stare off in the distance and don't turn around suddenly. Well, I guess it was his day of making a choice. Maybe because it was the two camera hacks, you know, a slight delay. According to the layout, the vault is between the ground and upper floors. Find a way up there. To get to the upper floor, you'll need a high security key card. Somebody here is sure to have one of those. Why don't you check one of the computers in the human resources department? That key card will give you access to the upper floor. There's the door to the vault. It requires a four-digit code to open. Try one more time to see where that staircase. Find them and turn off the right switches. Very tricky system, this. The wiring logic's changed. Keep checking that you get the right switches. Now switch off the lasers. Watch out. Okay, that was a good speed. That's really good. Nicely done. On to the next. That took me 10 seconds. All right. Next, we need a blue key card. But the vault will only unlock... All right, whatever happens here, we're fucking... Unless the like, guard computer. fucking gets shooting, then I think this Once is the you run. activate the vault from the manager's computer, you have a short amount of time to get back here and unlock it with the blue key There you key go, card. we rush now. I'd find the key card first. I need to go rub up on a civilian. Oh, this fucking guard. All doors just starting to open. Right about yes, now. Yes, I'm good, I guess. Door number one. Right on time. Okay, remember, we're here for the server and the cache. Let's hope all the details on Shark's dirty deals are on that server, including information about the conspiracy. It's annoying because with Rush, I can pick up bags faster and throw them. Two better bags are glitched. I say rub up on a civilian whenever we're in the lobby. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna open this door for you too. Now we're fucking chunky as hell. And take as much money as you can mm. carry. It's time for payback. Hi, it's me. One bag and counting. And then we're gonna have to rub up again on them. Just grab a bag and then fucking hit a civilian. And then I'll go for the server. Sounds good. Guard is coming, I hear him. Three bags and counting. It's fine, hack him if you can. Because it's all on the server, remember? It's all on the server. All right, now I'm just full Secure sending it down there. Just careful though, we don't want an alarm going off yet. 335. I'm gonna hit the civilian. All right, I'm coming. Almost the same as our last run. <laughs> I could have just made it in. It might be like a few seconds. I know you were the first time. Now come along. I think we're, we're definitely a couple seconds faster. Like, like what? Two, three seconds faster? I'm taking it. I don't, four seconds left from last time, I guess. I uh, know. I said 59, so five seconds. All right, that's still a good number. Okay, I mean, we did the best we could with glitched bags. Yeah, five bags. So you could save probably almost 30 to 40 seconds on your solo run, just based off not having those two extra bags.